got a longer stride than me. If you look at him, he's already a freaking half a tree length away. Hand fallers Jim Gardner and Rob Winger are first up the hill, blazing the trail on the hunt for that prized big wood. It's a uh, in-depth uh, look at uh, our logging and harvesting company and how uh, we live a unique lifestyle on the coast, uh, doing the world's most dangerous job. So uh, excited to show the world. And you have an entire crew that works with you, but you know, these are massive, highly valuable trees that can be worth up to $70,000 each. Is that correct? Like, talk to me about that. That's massive. Yeah, that's correct. Uh, some of these uh, bigger trees that we scout out and find, uh, they're kind of at the end of their life cycle, so we have to catch them before they get too rotten. But uh, if we get that right tree and, and uh, we can get it out of the woods without uh, damaging it, it can be worth quite a bit of a money. So that's the goal is to try to uh, capture as much uh, money and create as many jobs and economy that we can out of the forest that we uh, live, breathe and work in. So uh, it's just a uh, unique job that uh, is highly dangerous at times, but uh, just want to show the world our side of the story, you know. A float camp is a floating hotel. 55 rooms, two story, has a rec room, weight room, big cookhouse. Rose beast. And I love it. You wake up and you're at work. And Jared, having a job like this, you know, how much of a liability is it cutting down some of the largest timber in the world? Uh, it's a huge liability, you know. Uh, Fallers, as we call them, timber fallers, that's the, uh, the most dangerous part of the job. Uh, you know, they're just uh, two two men and they are the softest thing in the forest. So, you know, they got to get out there and uh, stay safe and rely on their uh, falling partner to stay safe. So, um, as you'll see, if you tune in on the show, um, these guys are dealing with some really technical stuff and they're doing it with a power saw and a few axes. So tune in to watch how they do it safely and, and productively. Now, Jared, what got you interested in doing something this dangerous as far as jumping in the world of big money logging? I just kind of uh, started logging when I was young and uh, just kind of got caught. We call it the, the, the trap of logging. You uh, end up working with, uh, you know, the biggest hearted men in the world. Uh, you know, these guys are away from their family as much as we are. They become your family. and. Uh, you know, you young guys that come into this business, they go out to the woods and uh, they keep keep their head on a swivel. They're always watching out for dangers. They come back to camp. They live with, you know, the old timers, the legends of this business. And uh, we kind of just train the younger people and they stay because of uh, just the lifestyle. It's, it's, uh, it's hard to explain. You'll have to tune in to watch. Well, thank you so much for coming on iHollywood TV. Be sure to catch The Last Woodsman airing with new episodes every Friday at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Pacific Standard Time on the Discovery Channel. Jared, you take care and you have a great day. Thank you so much for talking with us about the show and we'll be watching. Perfect. Thank you, Noah. Have a good day.